Willkommen in Berlin. Welcome to Berlin. <laughs> it is my second full day here in Berlin on my mini trip in April that I'm taking with my friend Sophie and my cousin who lives in Germany and he joined us here. Just like in the previous vlog that I filmed and published about this very geeky trip, we started today with the Artes Museum or the old museum just behind me which holds all of the Greek, Roman and Etruscan antiquity exhibitions. Really, really good stuff. You will see all of the B-roll that I have filmed and I will show you a little bit more around this beautiful area in the city center of Berlin. And maybe we get to go on a boat trip on the river as well. And now it's time to tell you, welcome to my channel. My name is Katarina George, I'm a vlogger and a writer. And here I publish vlogs about my Romanian heritage, about my experience as a Romanian living in the UK now, and also about traveling. Traveling, which is one of my big, big, big passions in life. As I said already, we are in Berlin now, where I'm taking a four days trip in April. I have to admit, I booked this because the flights were very affordable at this time of the year. I had hoped for nicer springtime weather. That hasn't been so kind with us so far, but you don't need nice weather to explore museums. So my first time in Berlin in 2015 has been in January for my birthday. And all I did then was museums, exhibitions, really tasty German food. So you can also do that if you want to pay less for such a trip. Today, as I said, I visited Altes Museum with all of the ancient uh, classic uh, ex exhibitions. I'll show you around so you can admire bits of these exhibitions as well. But I have to recommend come and see them for real. I'm happy you are watching my vlog. I'm happy that you're here on my channel. If you enjoy what you're watching, also remember to subscribe so you can see what I'm gonna publish later on. But seeing these things for real, that's why I'm making these vlogs, because I hope to inspire people to travel and discover such places for themselves.
Look at the weather right now. It is our last day in Berlin in our April 22 trip. And I think it's the irony that follows people who travel from the UK all over Europe and all over the world. You get there, the first day is a bit uh, sunny and nicer weather. And then the miserable UK weather seems to follow you around. <laughs> Yesterday, you saw the footage that we did uh, out and about. It was pretty miserable, rain hanging on the horizon. Well, that's it. Berlin is beautiful no matter what, regardless of the weather. The museums are great and we are lucky to have this wonderful, bright, sunny day to soak it up. While we don't follow any pre-planned um, uh, tours, we're just going to take the parts of the city on our last day here before our evening flight. We are at Alexanderplatz now. You can see over there, you know, the base of the television tower. It's an activity that I have to leave for another time. We couldn't fit it in these three, three, four, yeah, two full days and two part days that we're spending here. You can also see behind me the beautiful Neptune fountain. A lot of people are taking photos around it because it's really, really an exquisite piece of architecture. I'm going to take you a little bit around with us as well today and I'm going to introduce to you and show you the B-roll that I filmed on the second activity of yesterday, which was the trip by boat on the river spread. Beautiful sightseeing, uh, a little bit of pre-recorded guided tour as well that we listened to, very relaxing. You just sit on the boat for an hour. We took the one hour trip. I will take you there and tell you more about this, more information so you can decide if you want to do that activity if you come to Berlin too. But yeah, this is it. Lovely, lovely, gorgeous weather on our last day in Berlin. across here walking from Alexander Platz to the museum's island there is a weekend arts fair here lots of stores we're gonna have a quick look and um, it looks really really good so if you're in Berlin at the weekend don't miss it it looks like I could spend the fortune here but I don't know how I'll carry it with me with just hand luggage on the airplane I don't know it's worth having a look though We are taking today completely at leisure. We just walked around the city center. We came across that arts market that I've already showed you. Walked past Pergamon Museum, the colonnades, across the river, on this bridge by the Berlin Dome. And there is the boat on which we went on a river tour yesterday. We only took the one hour tour because in the evening they don't do the longer two hours and a half ones. 
Um, but we still saw the Bundestag and other landmarks such as the central uh, train station in Berlin. Train stations here are really beautiful because they're all metal and glass. You can still see the city while you're waiting for your train and that feels like a much better experience than just being you know, between walls <laughs> and getting bored with uh, just looking at walls or on your phone, of course. <laughs> I completely recommend take one of the uh, tour boats here on the river, on the river Spree. I think that's the pronunciation in, in German. Uh, the one hour tour that we took cost about 18 euro, but you can also order drinks, um, coffee, beers, whatever. So you relax listen to the guided tour and admire the city from a completely different point of view as well. Here we are on the museum's island inside the colonnades that surround the old art gallery and Neues Museum here. Just one step away from the Berlin Cathedral, Berlin Dome. We started here with the two vlogs that I filmed for you about Berlin our geeky exploration of this amazing city, of the history that you can find here and the cultural side, the architecture, some of the attractions and of course we only scratched the surface of what Berlin can be all about. I will have to wrap this vlog up here while soaking the sun <laughs> and filming this last bit of my second vlog. I do really hope that you enjoyed it. I hope that uh, you liked all the samples uh, of the exhibitions from the two, from the three museums that I brought for you in these vlogs. If you haven't watched the first one, I will link it below in the description. And if you enjoyed watching this vlog, remember to give me thumbs up. Also, if you're not subscribed already, remember to subscribe to my channel so you can see all of the other vlogs that I'm going to bring for you in the future. I think it is time to go grab a cup of, cup of tea before we head to the airport now. So until next time, ciao for now!